You're watching ABC On Demand. Genius. This is the house, and I'm the genius. And what I got here is my latest invention. The Von Drake Remote Controlled Laser Lawnmower. Ooh, that's some diagram there. Now, when we're pushing the remote button, there extends the white hot electron laser blade. And whoa, look at that. Bye-bye, <laughs> gardener. See you later. Allow me to demonstrate, would you? Oh, brilliant! Ah! Perhaps a little adjustment is in order. So much for my laser lawnmower. But how about my new haircut? Isn't that something? See you next time! a watchdog just sits there while a burglar robs his house. Ooh. What if a real burglar broke in here, huh? What then? Looks like I'm gonna have to get me a better watchdog, one with a lick of sense. Ooh. Pluto, come in here and meet the new watchdog. Muncie, this is Pluto. Pluto, meet Muncie. Roll. Guy who sold me, Muncie, says he's the smartest dog he ever trained. <laughs> Aw, chin up, Pluto. You're still my best pup. Say, you want to fetch the paper? <laughs> Atta 
a boy, man, see? Here you go, Muncie. <laughs> a little something for putting my mind at ease. I'll sure sleep better knowing you're protecting the place. my birthday so true it's mine happy birthday to me you're <laughs> not a dog seller you're a cat burglar get him muncie yeah! so that's your game huh sell me a watchdog that helps you rob my house you know good thieving thief <laughs> for my purse? Thank 
you, Donald? <laughs> ah, nuts. century ago, before airplanes filled the air, I said before they filled the... Uh, thank you. The world was a bigger place. Especially for a mouse. Mickey Mouse was the caretaker of the Humbleton Orphanage. Morning, Clarabelle. Looks like you have your hooves full. Yay! Hey! That looks pretty good. Despite his steadfast efforts, the orphanage was in grave financial trouble. Bills? 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 Oh, gosh. How are we ever going to pay them? Say, what's this? Dear Mr. Mouse, congratulations. You have inherited a fortune. Junk mail. Wait a minute. Let's see. To claim your inheritance, your presence is requested at the Reform Club at precisely 6 o'clock. Greedily, your Scrooge McDuck. No! I'm already late! You're late. Sorry. Do I still get my money? <laughs> we'll see, won't we? <laughs> For as the executor of your great uncle's will, it is my responsibility to carry out his instructions and bequeath to you his fortune. Oh boy, the orphanage is saved. That is, only if I deem you to be a trustworthy, hardworking, and punctual member of society. <laughs> Gosh, pretty much everybody knows they can trust Mickey Mouse. And gee, uh, Goofy and I have been working real hard running that orphanage. And in regards to being punctual... You mean, uh, <laughs> like not being late? Yes. For example, arriving on time to important engagements such as this. No, oh, for once, don't live up to your name, Scrooge, and give the lad his money. Yes, the old boy's a fine chap. I'll gladly give Mr. Mouse his money. Gee, thanks. As soon as he passes a small test to prove his punctuality. Test? What kind of test? Ah, how about going round the world in 80 days? Around the world in 80 days? But he'd have to catch every train. Make every ship. And never be late. Not even once. It's the perfect test. And you believe today, October 1st, that makes you due back here on the 19th of December at 6.30. Have a nice trip. So, um, if the old boy doesn't make it, what becomes of the money? If Mr. Mouse fails to pass the test, his entire inheritance reverts to the executor. Why, Scrooge, that's you. Exactly. Goofy! Hiya, Mickey. Just taking care of today's bills. Put down that broom and pack your bags. <laughs> We're going around the world in 80 days. Come on, let's go. What's the big hurry? We're not leaving for 80 days. So Mickey and his goofy companion were off, travelling by boat from London to Paris, where they were to catch a train. Hey, 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 Having barely made their connection, they took the train to Italy. Brindisi, Italy, to be exact. Goofy, do you mind? Oh, yep. <laughs> Sorry. From Brindisi, they crossed the Mediterranean Sea to Egypt, then crossed the Arabian Sea to Bombay. And all was right on schedule until... <sighs> what rotten luck. There's no way I can make it now. Hey, Mickey, grab your bags. <laughs> we can take this here pachyderm.
going on? A wedding? Come on, we gotta keep moving. We're losing time. Shame. A beautiful young princess that looks kind of like you marrying somebody else. Oh, well, let's go. Wait. Huh? We can't go. Why not? We gotta save her. Save her? I said save her. Mickey? Psst. <gasps> Who are you? A friend. <laughs> Did you hear, Scrooge? The old boys reached Bob Bay. Looks like you'll be handing over that inheritance after all. Not necessarily, for I will make sure that Mr. Mickey Mouse's 80 days are numbered. And so Mickey Mouse with Goofy and Princess Minnie continued his trip around the world by crossing mainland China. voyage across the Pacific, Mickey found himself thinking less and less about money and more and more about Minnie. To make it across the Wild West, our traveling trio resorted to goofy power. Whoa, whoa. The final leg from New York to London would take nine days via steamship, arriving in the early morning of Sunday the 19th, just in time. That is, unless they were to have a run-in with one greedy duck. You're gonna love London, and after I pay off all the bills, I'm gonna show you the best time money can buy. We'll have a fancy dinner and, and take in a show, maybe even go dancing. <sighs> So romantic. <laughs> it will be. I mean, uh huh. It will be. <laughs> it's horrible. It's terrible. And it's awful, too. <laughs> yep. Am I interrupting? Aw, oh, Goofy, what is it? The coal. Somebody dumped all the coal off the boat. <laughs> Nuts! Well, we'll never make it on time. Oh, we gotta make it! We just need to think of something else we can use as fuel. Oh, gee, the only other thing I can think of that can burn is wood. But where can we get wood in the middle of the ocean? Bet you thought I was gonna fall. the fancy dinner and, and the show and the dancing I promised you. You'll just have to go without me. Oh, Goofy. Looks like the orphanage can't afford to keep you around any longer. Here, I I'm sure the pawn shop will give you a fair price for this. Well, I can't take your watch. And I don't want your money. But I don't get it. I'm your friend, Mickey. And that don't cost you a penny. And I love you, not your money. Gosh, 
Really? You bet. Oh, you guys are just swell. Well, time to tell everybody the bad news. Say, do you hear bells? I do. And so do I. But why are church bells ringing on Monday? Unless... We gained one whole day when we crossed the international date line. That means it's one day earlier than we thought. Looks like he's not going to make it. He's not late yet, Scrooge. Oh, yes, the old boy still has a chance. Five, four, three, two... Show, old boy. I knew you'd do it. And so it came to pass that Mickey Mouse made the journey around the world in 80 days. And he and Minnie lived happily ever after. One Saturday morning on ABC. <laughs> oh, boy! We'll be right back to Disney's One Saturday Morning. Control. Humans, witness that technology of the physical universe on a string. Yo. Hey, yo. Tiger's electronic yo yo to calibrate your stats as it spins. Stage one. Speed. To keep track of how fast EO rotates in miles per hour using a sleek LCD system. Stage two. Distance. Measures distance and actual miles to see how far EO's gone. Stage three. Time. How long can you sleep it? EO measures time in relative mathematical units. Stage four. A body in motion stays in motion. This is the modern age of the electronic yo yo. EO. Hey, yo. 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 It's your yo yo. Batteries are included. I'm Dominique Dawes, and I want to talk to you about girl power. We're all good at different things. So, whatever you do, give it your best shot. Girl power. Call 1-800-729-6686. Welcome back to Disney's One Saturday Morning. We'll be right back to Disney's One Saturday Morning. Meet this cool toy Noah's friends. Hey! Hey! Yeah. It's Disney's The Adventures of Ichabod and Mr. Toad. Come along! We'll go for a jolly ride. It's jumping with fun. Hey! What have I been missing? Go totally toad wild with Disney's The Adventures of Ichabod and Mr. Toad. Now on video for the first time. Rated G. Yeah. If you were a hamster, you'd live in a cage. You'd play on a wheel. And when you got hungry, you'd eat pellets. You know why? Because you're a hamster. You don't like pellets? Tough. Hamsters don't have a choice, but you do because you're a kid. That means you can have it your way. You know why you can have it your way? Because you can go to Burger King. And when you have it your way, it tastes better. If you want a cheeseburger, get a cheeseburger. You don't want pickles? Don't get pickles. Get ketchup. You can get a cool toy. You can get what you want at Burger King. Hey, you don't like choices? Be a hamster. You want it your way? You can go to Burger King. Taste rules. They hired a bum to be their principal. We have a sale on canned peaches in aisle three. Zachary Ty Bryan, Kevin Nealon, Principal Takes a Holiday, ABC Sunday at 7, 6 Central. Welcome back to Disney's One Saturday Morning. We'll be 
be right back to Disney's One Saturday Morning. of Tropical Punch Shampoo. <laughs> Say goodbye to tears. L'Oreal <laughs> No nasty knots. L'Oreal <laughs> Shiny hair. New formula for super neat hair. New L'Oreal Kids Burst of Tropical Punch Shampoo. Because we're worth it too. What do you want? You got parts for a pod racer? Why are you building one? Lego and Star Wars join forces so you can build authentic Lego Episode One pod racers. Command Gungan subs. Pilot Naboo fighters. Battle Darth Maul Sith infiltrators. You've got what it takes to win the day. If you win, we split the 50-50. The new Lego Star Wars Episode One collection. Each set sold separately. Saturday morning. We'll be right back to Disney's One Saturday Morning. Drinks are on me. Come on. Kool-Aid. Destination fun. And lots of funky, fruity ways to get there. No, big man! Oh, yeah. With the Game Boy Camera, you can doctor up that picture of Sis any way you want to. It's free from Kool-Aid along with other neat Nintendo stuff, like a Pokemon Game Pack. See Ticket to Fun order form for details, and you can mail it in along with Kool-Aid points plus postage and handling. You can even get a Game Boy printer. Coming only to theaters June 18th. Experience an all-new motion picture event. Tarzan. Walt Disney Pictures proudly presents Tarzan. Coming June 18th. Your favorite courtroom pals are back and better than ever with two new characters and a whole new name. Squiggle Vision. Check this out. ABC next. Tonight, get ready for the most surprising and outrageous blunders you'll ever see on a Saturday night. It's America's Funniest Home Videos, followed by The Big Moment, ABC Tonight. Next, find out how rockets really work when J.C. Cramwood takes Jane Plain to science court. It's Squiggle Vision, next, right here on ABC. You're watching ABC. 